we are so excited to have everybody here. Thank you for joining us. My name is Jillian Smith. I'm the Executive Director of the Fulton County Chamber, and we are here for a ribbon cutting of the Time Theater. First, I'd like to turn it over to Pastor Kurt Nichols. I just want to thank Julian for the opportunity to speak because one of the things that draws communities together, of course, is shared memories. And I know a lot of you have a lot of memories with this place from Saturday afternoon matinees to maybe your first kiss. I don't know, I'm not gonna ask. But I can tell you that the, the, the investment of a community into the memories of their past is so important as everything is being rearranged and changed. We have an opportunity and we have reclaimed this. So thank you to the board for being a part of this. All of those that donated their countless hours of uh, uh, sweat and tears to work on there, to Mr. Scott for his art, to all those that donated, because money makes the world go around. Thank you very much. And this is a great opportunity to extend the arts now into a next generation and build new memories. Do I get to pray real quick? Sure. All right, I'm going to say a quick prayer. Bless, O oh Lord, this place. May it be a haven of connection and love and sharing of the arts. And these things you all have blessed as good. We thank you for this time together. We will remember it as a legacy in our lives. Amen. 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 I am done. Thank you. We have seen this project for years and years, and we are so fortunate to have Julia Schamberger, who's been leading the charge as chairman of the board for the past year. Julia, would you like to say a few words? I just want to say it begins again today. Everybody, every memory, every effort, every person that volunteered, donated money, served on the board, be it for a long time or a little, we're all here together today, and let's get this thing going. Thank you. Courtney Papa to come up. She's representing Senator Young's office. Hi. Senator wishes he could be here today, but he did send a few words. Um, it's an honor to write you today as you celebrate the grand reopening of the Times Theater. As you know, a lot of hard work and fundraising went into reopening this theater. Thank you for putting in those hours, and thanks to the board for leading this incredible project. I am confident that the Times Theater will serve Rochester community as a destination for entertainment and the arts for all ages. It is inspiring to see the Rochester community rally around this effort, and I sincerely thank all who have helped to make the reopening of the Times Theater a reality. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. And now I'd like to invite the Mayor of Rochester, Ted Denton. Thank you, Jillian. First of all, whenever uh, Pastor Kurt and I are together outside, it usually rains or snows, so everybody <laughs> will move this along as quickly as we can. I have a little something to read to you and to present to you, All right. putting in the lobby or whatever you want to do. Dear Mayor Denton, I'd like to take this opportunity to congratulate President Julie Schambarger, volunteers and board members of Kind Stitter on their over six years of time, dedication and investment in the revitalization of this Rochester landmark. Time Stitter has brought many good times and great memories to the citizens of Rochester and Fulton County for almost a century. It is particularly gratifying to know that over $100,000 of the investment for facade work for this worthwhile project came from OPRA, the state's organization for rural community development. This upgrade to the historical corridor of downtown Rochester is how a community improves while retaining its cultural Roots. Again, congratulations and best wishes for at least another 99 years of success. That's right. Sincerely, Suzanne Crouch, Lieutenant Governor of the State of Indiana. Thank you. That means we have one year to work all the bugs out and get this right for the 100th year celebration. Let's do this. <laughs> I'd also like to invite Bill Rowe to come forward. Oh, dear. Oh, dear. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Well, Julie, everybody knows oh, yeah. the driving force behind this. 
and we just want to show a little pretty. Even though you yell at us all the time. And I guess I should have said Bill Rowe, owner of Hosted Decor, who exactly. has put in hundreds of hours uh, in the last week. <laughs> and volunteered on the weekends off the clock. Like, enough. Well, cut this ribbon. Let's cut this ribbon. Do it. Do it. Okay. Yeah, Bill. Oh, I had a speech. And they were. Oh, Lord. <laughs> Oh, this is not going to work. Tell me when. <laughs> I'm going to take off the really? point. Look at the camera. Get all those photos for everybody who wants them. Chinese boy. <laughs> 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 